Hey everyone, so today I'm going to teach you how to make these kind of bread like things. You can use these as like snacks, you can use these as burger buns, which I did, you can use this as a pizza base. It's really up to you. It's just a really nice bread like texture, except it's wheat free, grain free, all of that good stuff, gluten free. So, this is what I made with my ones. Um, I might do a recipe for these another time, but I'm showing you how to make the bread portion. And also Kelly has made some wraps, she's made some sweet wraps and savoury wraps and shown you how to make that delicious looking wrap part. So let's get started. So first of all you want four egg whites and I'm going to save the yolks and use them in something else. You want to need some facilian husk or however you say that, coconut flour, baking soda. You'll also need some natural salt and some boiling water and a little bit of apple cider vinegar. Preheat your oven to about 160 degrees Celsius and then you want to mix together all of your dry ingredients in a large bowl and I'll write all of the precise measurements in the down bar. Next add in your apple cider vinegar and your four egg whites. You want to combine this until it's thoroughly combined, clearly, um, and then add in your boiling water. You want just under half a cup and that'll give you a really nice kind of texture. It'll appear quite wet at first but it'll just turn into like a doughy kind of thing. Um, and then you can just take them into balls or into flatten balls like what I did and just separate them. You can do lots or you can do a few and then put them in the oven for about 25 minutes or so until they're really really nice and golden on the outside. I served mine as little burgers. I make my own burgers, um, my own meat patties and if you want a recipe just let me know and they were delicious. So yum. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you try it out hashtag me on Instagram or Twitter or show it to me on Facebook. Have a really good day and I'll talk to you soon. See you!